Um, I could pretend to be nonchalant about it, but actually I am very excited. Yeah, I'm absolutely thrilled. I mean, just over the moon, over the moon. I mean, this book has been, you know, a labor of love. It's been a, a passion project. It's taken me five years to get it over the line. And I am so thrilled that it's out there in the world and that children are reading it and responding to it. You know, I was very moved by the Syrian refugee crisis. I felt I had to write about it in some form. Um, and I've obviously written 15 adult novels, so I wasn't thinking about children, but the voice of the child kept coming to me and she was 11 and I felt I had to be in her voice. And so I, I decided I was going to write it for kids. Um, and really, you know, I wrote it because I feel so strongly that the best way for children to understand the lives of others is to get them to walk a mile in somebody else's shoes. When I was a teenager, I think the book that inspired me most was Little Women because the character of Jo March, uh, she's one of the four sisters, really wanted to be a writer and she failed in her first attempts, but she kept grafting and getting better and eventually she got published. And when I was trying to get published, I was failing miserably and I kept grafting and becoming better and eventually I got published and I've now published many novels. So I, I always, uh, I loved her as a child and I loved her as an adult because I used to think, think back to her uh, when I was you know, dealing with rejection, so yeah. What inspired me to become a writer was my love of words. Uh, I think I'm much better at expressing myself in the written word than I am verbally. Um, I can make sense of the world and sort of make sense of what's going on in my own head by writing it down. And I definitely think I am more eloquent when I write than when I speak. Um, I'm actually going to put it in my office because on those days when I want to throw my laptop out the window because I think what I'm currently writing is rubbish, I'm going to look at this and go, no, I can do this. <laughs>